today we're going to teach you how to make a Long Island iced tea. First, there are a couple things that you're going to need to use to make the Long Island iced tea correctly. We need a mixing glass and a large tin shaker. We're going to use this to mix our ingredients. Next, we need a measuring tool of some kind. In this case, I'm going to use a double-ended uh, measuring cup. Of course, we need ice. Then we need rum, triple sec, gin, vodka, a can of coke, and sour mix. The first step in this is to take our large glass and fill it with ice. Okay. Now we want to mix uh, each of these alcohols in equal parts. So first we're going to start with the rum. Then the gin, and then our vodka. Next, we're going to fill with Coke. And add a splash of the lemon sour mix. Next, we're going to take the steel shaker lid, place it on top, make sure that it's firmly secured, and give it a little shake. Next, we need our glass. Fill the glass with our Long Island iced tea. And there it is. But we're not done yet. The last thing that we have to do is dress our drink. So first we're going to need a cutting board, a sharp knife, a lemon. We're going to take our knife Cut down through the lemon. Making a thin lemon slice. Okay. Stick it on the side of the glass. Last, a straw. Next, I'm going to show you how to make a Mai Tai. Again, we're going to need a few of the same simple tools. A double-ended measuring cup, a glass mixer, and a tin lid. Need our rum, triple sec, amaretto, Sour mix. This time we need pineapple juice and a little grenadine. And we need ice. So first, I'm going to take my shaker, fill it with ice. Take my two-ended uh, 
measure and measure off. So it's one whole ounce of rum. A half ounce, we'll say. And then a half ounce of rum. Right Next, we need equal parts of sour mix and pineapple juice. Okay. Get our mixer. Make sure it's tight. Again, we have our lemon and our knife. Let's not forget the straw. And that is my time.